Namaste. A mind all logic is like a knife all blood. It makes the hand bleed that uses it, says Rabindranath Tagore. So too much of logic eventually spoils your life. You become a dry arid land. Through this logic, you may earn a thousand dollars or lakhs of rupees. But still, life remains a dry arid land. So on one hand, this logic and this intellect will let you earn your livelihood. But on the other hand, it may steal the love from your life. In this podcast, I am going to speak more on Virgo, the sixth zodiac sign. So let's begin. Virgo ideally is the sign of critics. The quality of doing excellent analysis is what makes Virgo a sign of critics. These men and women don't spare themselves also. They indulge in self-criticism. Self-criticism is defined as the tendency to engage in negative self-evaluation that results in feelings of worthlessness, failure and guilt when expectations are not met. Self-criticism leads to the development of depression and depression can lead to suicidal tendencies. Mercury is the master of Virgo sign and you all know how Mercury is. Mercury has absolutely no emotions but is excellent in calculations. Mercury is good when it comes to communication skills. Mercury is very calculative and Mercury is the source of intellectualism. Although intellectualism is a poor substitute to intelligence, natives of these signs do well in life, meaning they are capable of earning good money since intellectualism is mechanical and so it sells faster than intelligence which is spiritual by nature. So you will find many great scientists, IT software specialists, doctors born with Virgo sign or major planets in Virgo sign. So overall the natives of this sign are capable of earning fortunes by using their intellectualism in their respective work fields. However, when it comes to intelligence, it depends on how evolved the soul is. Else the majority of the Virgo folks remain in the world of intellectualism and miss to experience the beauty of divine intelligence. Always remember, when you are dealing with a Virgo native, you are dealing with a head and not a heart. When it comes to Leo, it is always heart first. However, when it comes to Virgo, it is always head first. And that is why I always say that great businessmen are born with Virgo sign. Since when it comes to business, you need a highly calculative level-headed person which a typical Virgo moon sign delivers. Virgo natives are very good when it comes to dealing with conflicts, dealing with chronic diseases, dealing with hidden agendas or hidden enemies.
great lawyers are also born with this placement as well as great medical practitioners are also born with moon in virgo film critics script writers mathematicians radio jockeys do well with virgo moon sign the most significant quality of virgo natives is that they will analyze and describe a certain person with such a great perfection that you will be dumbfounded i remember a few months ago i had given an appointment to an indian woman based in new york and as we got connected over the phone she started with such a beautiful analysis of my podcast channel that she described each and everything about my podcast and how she loves my voice and how i go about my podcast and so many of her observations she shared with me over the phone that i was astonished these natives are very good at describing each and every details of a certain person with such a perfection that you will be dumbfounded of course it all depends on the overall maturity of the person a person at the base level may still not have this analytic power though a virgo person at the highest level of awareness will have great analytic power so it all depends on the level of awareness virgo men and virgo women look younger than their actual age especially if you are born with a virgo ascendant then you will always look younger compared to your actual age example a woman born with virgo moon or virgo ascendant may have crossed her 50s but still she may look much younger than her age and since mercury is youthful mischievous and childish by nature these men and women also remain a child at heart so they are playful and they always look younger and they are also driven towards those who look younger although i am not a great fan of virgo sign still i must say that in my life i have had connections with many virgo men and women but most of them were modified virgo natives now you may wonder what is this modified virgo virgin modified virgo means when along with the moon there is jupiter or sun or venus or mars or saturn or rahu or ketu in virgo sign so whenever moon is not alone in virgo then you get a modified version of virgo person my favorite modified version of virgo sign is when virgo moon is with jupiter when jupiter comes in contact with a highly intellectual analytical virgo moon it changes the whole nature of virgo sign now you will see a highly intelligent person he or she must be a very spiritual person by nature they may have much interest in meditations and chanting they may actually take the efforts towards their self growth then such a moon jupiter virgo person becomes the most sought after person because the power of mercury and jupiter in virgo bless him or her with many divine gifts of god in my life i had met a few virgo person having moon with jupiter in virgo sign and i must say that they were blessed with divine intelligence so you see the presence of jupiter in virgo along with moon simply changes the whole meaning of the otherwise dry sign of virgo i have absolutely no hesitation in mentioning that virgo is a dry sign because it is too much into the head when there is only head and only logic in your life then life becomes a dry arid land 
आई कैन नॉट स्टैंड टू द वर्जिन वर्गो साइन वर्जिनिटी इज अ साइन ऑफ ड्राइनेस स्टिल देर इज नो जूस इन योर लाइफ स्टिल यू आर अ वर्जिन स्टिल यू हैवंट येट एक्सपीरियंस्ड द रियल जूस ऑफ लाइफ विच कम्स थ्रू द अबोर्ड ऑफ लव When sex happens through the abode of love then there is no sexuality in it however if there is no love but just lust then sex becomes ugly so the juice of life is love but when it comes to virgo since they are too much in the head they tend to take a lot of time in committing to love and that is exactly what happened with a great scholar and his name was emmanuel kant he must be a virgo person because he was a great scholar but you should remember scholars are too much in their head and logic love is missing the juice of life is missing and so emmanuel kant though was a great scholar somehow he wasn't able to find a suitable marriage partner this is one common symptom of virgo sign marriage is always challenging finding a marriage partner is always difficult for these natives and so emmanuel kant remained single and he was not aware that there was one woman a beautiful woman and she had fell in love with him and the woman waited for many days and months she thought that kant will propose her but kant was so much caught in his head that it never occurred to him that someone had fallen in love with him and so after waiting for many months finally the woman proposed him in the first place it is bad that the girl should propose it is always the boy who proposes but the girl must have waited and waited and kant wouldn't propose the idea never occurred to him he was so much rooted in his head the heart was denied so the girl feeling too much time had been lost finally proposed kant said i will think it over how can you think about love either it is there or not it is not a question to be solved it is a situation to respond to either your heart says yes or your heart says no and it is finished what will you think it is not a business proposal but it was a business proposal to kant too much head orientation makes everything business like so he thought and he not only thought he went to the library and concentrated on the books about love about marriage then he noted down in his notebook all that was in favor of marriage and all that was against and he thought and thought and thought and it is said that after evaluating the pros and cons he decided in favor of marriage because a few points were more in favor than against so it was a logical decision then he went and knocked at the girl's door and the father said she is already married and a mother of three children so much time passed you came a little late this is what happens with virgo natives they take a lot of time when it comes to making a decision by chance if a virgo woman expresses her love towards you then i must say that you are very special because otherwise a virgo person generally is not very candid in expressing his or her love evolved souls born in virgo sign have a sixth sense sixth sense is the ability to perceive the subtle world or the unseen world of angels and ghosts depending on the nature of the soul he or she is able to sense and see the unseen world of ghosts or angels a meditative soul will sense the positive angels while a negative person will experience the ghostly souls
However, since Mercury is connected with spells and air, the connection with the subtle or sukshma world becomes easier for Mercurian Virgo natives, provided the quality of their horoscope is good. Command over the language, master of words, a man of letters, qualities of becoming a scholar of a certain subject, sharp business acumen and a very calculative brain is what makes a Virgo person capable of achieving his or her life goals. These natives are often wondering about the purpose of their life. They are always trying to find the meaning of life because it is Mercury. You see, Mercury is always behind finding the meaning. They completely forget the fact that life itself has no meaning. Life is an opportunity to create meaning. Meaning is not to be discovered, it has to be created. And you can create meaning only when you are alive. And how can you live your life by being alive? Always remember, you either spend your life by being alive or by just existing. The source that enables you to live your life by being alive is love. This love is missing in Virgo sign native's life. Because of too much of focus on the head and the logic, love goes on missing and then your life becomes a dry arid land, a dead land. The oasis of life is only to be found in love. Always remember, without love, a man is just a body, an empty temple without the deity. With love, the deity arrives. The temple is no more empty. That's why love gives such fullness, such deep contentment, such tremendously overflowing joy. Remain in love and let love be the door to the divine. That is the message to all my followers born with Virgo moon sign or Virgo ascendant. That you have done enough as far as your intellectualism is concerned. Now start focusing on love. And to experience love, first you have to start loving yourself. You have to stop self-criticism and you have to learn to accept yourself as you are. Remember, when you accept yourself, you become beautiful. Many Virgo women and men are beautiful, handsome. They take great efforts in keeping themselves in a good shape. However, you should also take efforts in putting your head aside and letting your heart well up. Because when heart overtakes the head, love wells up. And if you live with love, through love, you will live a great life. Because love makes everything great. Focus on love. Remember, what you focus on grows. Love to all Virgo men and women. Stay blessed and remember to meditate every day. Jai Sri Ganesha. Jai Guru. Om Gam Ganapatai Namaha Om Gam Ganapatai Namaha Om Gam Ganapatai Namaha